Hello, hello, and welcome to Aurora's Gameworks, where we play some games and see if they work. Today, we're back at Horizon Forbidden West. Be sure to like this video, subscribe to this madness, and comment down below to feed those algorithm gods. And without further ado, let's get back to the adventure. Still in the prologue, but ah, man, I'm just so happy and surprised with what's going on in here. Look how beautiful that looks. My goodness. All right, we gotta get down there to chase the big snake machine. Actually, we're not chasing the machine, we're getting to a quote-unquote backup of Gaia. The AI that, uh, controlled the Hra Zero Dawn uh, project, which allowed the world to come back from pure annihilation. Machine-driven annihilation. Oh, that's- ah, uh, yo! <laughs> Good, there was water there. You're fine, Aoi. Aoi? Aloy. Just walk it off. Just walk it off. I'm way too excited. I need to take a few deep breaths. Alright. Four second inhales. Four second exhales. Ah, yes. I'm just so. I'm just so pumped. I, I, I want to be exploring all the things. I want to... I want to bathe underneath this waterfall. I want to walk with you on the mountain. I want to bathe with you in the sea. <laughs> Alright, if I can go the rest of the video without singing another 90s song, I'll consider that a very great victory. <laughs> I, hope, I hope you do too. But secretly, you want it. You know you do. You're just like, man, I really hope Rory throws out some more rascally 90s hits like that. Needed in our life like Cherry Cherry Cola. Wow. That big metal thing looks like the ship we saw back in the auditorium. Imagine going up to the stars in that. Yeah. I'm imagining it, my friend. Leaving the world behind. Adventuring far off locations in the Sirius system, which probably has M3 planets, why not? For the sake of this, let's imagine they do. Can anyone confirm? Can someone confirm in the comments if Sirius does have any M3 Machines planets? Ahead. That like would be habitable wise. Can we tell that? We can tell that. We're smart people. We sneak into the bush. Let us equip our rocks. The greatest tool of a silent warrior. I see you. I'm gonna tag you. And I'm gonna tag you, buddy. Oh, I know how this game works, game. You don't need to tell me how to game, game. I know how to game. See this? Oop, gamer move right there. Please don't see me. Varl, you're being seen, my friend. <laughs> Silent strike, bitch. I'm gonna do the same thing to your friend, too. He ain't gonna know I'm here. He's gonna be like, where'd my friend go? And I'll be like, to robot hell. <laughs> Silicon hell, I do believe it's called. And you'll go in there, too. <laughs> Ha 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 Aloy! Master hunter of machine- Ah, oh, fuck this more! <laughs> Where did you come from? Oh, you're a scrapper. Like, I- I killed the dude and you were like, mm, Gotta do my job now! Scrapping for parts. You can go to Silicon Hill too, my friend. Right in the pooper. Okay. You're a robot. Get out of here. Okay. Good, everything's fine. Any more scrappers? I mean, I have no qualm with killing an infinite Machine amount of scrappers. Right Just getting a, a metal shards. Like, infinitely. <laughs> then I can buy all the things in this world. Aloy, I know you just started, but here is the machine killing uh, spear of Avalon. I'll be like, cool, I got infinite shards, I'll buy it. 
And they'd be like, oh, we didn't anticipate this. Uh, no, you can't have it. An ancient supply chest. And more down here. There's a ladder in the back. What a miss. What a miss that was. You guys didn't see that. I'm going to edit that out. <laughs> I can't edit that out. I need to have some kind of integrity. I want to. I really, I really would like to get rid of that. But alas, poor Rory has standards. You will watch me fail because failing is sometimes a part of the process. And as the wonderful uh, captain of the Enterprise something. once said, Sona was uh, the third Enterprise, Enterprise C and D, back to the sacred lands? or is it just D? As the Nora war chief, she understood why I was obligated to follow you. But as my mother, she wasn't pleased. Was she ever pleased? I don't think I've seen her smile. <laughs> me neither. Anywho, before I was rudely interrupted by that great dialogue, uh, Jean-Luc Picard once said that you may do all the right things and still fail. That's life. Keep that in mind, my little chitlins. Away we go! Towards adventure! I like how Aloy has, like, no nonsense when it comes to, like, climbing ladders. She's like, yeah, I know ladder, uh, visuals and games can be annoying sometimes, so I'm just gonna, like, bust it up this ladder. She's got some moves. I appreciate that. I appreciate your hustle! Where's the supply chest? Am I dumb? No, I picked it up. So, yes, I am dumb. In a matter of speaking. I'm a seller boy. She's hungry for them loots. Can't go down there. Okay, just make sure. Oh, what a great sight. And they will exemplify that with a nice little cutscene. Oh, that's terrible. Just a King Cobra robot. Oh, the three of them. Good. <laughs> you know what? I was hoping. And if they slaughtered all those Osram, we'll never get through to the data center. Yeah. There's no way to slip We're all dead. That's it. I give up. We could find a settlement. Convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. That thing? How? Magic. We'll figure it out. Just wait here. Aloy. Trust me. And there she goes. <laughs> I'm only trusting you because my faith in Just this false to god you've told me to about how to make it fall into the basin. makes me. So we're gonna drop a shuttle on some robot cobras. Okay. What? Pray tell, job do these cobra uh, robots have? I imagine they're like utilize their corrosive venom to break down metal. Kind of like how scrappers will scrap uh, other machines and recycle. Oh, uh, you didn't see me. <laughs> no, I'm sneaky. I'm not seeing. You're crazy. No, nope, well, everything's fucked. Alright, we're gonna do this old school. With might and magic. Oh, I need a critical strike hit. That's what you get for getting hit, you face. Nope. Oh, please hit. Alright, using some health. I'm paying attention to my health this time. Man, his attacks are like so wibbly wobbly. <laughs> the controller um, speaker is just like, whenever I miss with my. Uh, with my spear, it's just like this big whiff noise. It's just like good. That's what I wanted. Ooh. No, thank you. And it just reminds me of how poorly I'm doing. 
the speaker's like, hey, you know you missed that? <laughs> you know you missed that attack too? <laughs> okay, speaker. I'm gonna need you to calm down. Stop being so bratty. What a jerk. All right. Like I said, I'm the master of stealthy huntiness. <laughs> I was wondering, like, why are there so many Heidi plants around? <sighs> That's me. Oblivious. Oh, I'm just picking up medicine berries that are just being sent to my stash. Dope. I like that. I had an excess and it's just like, would you like to send this excess to an excess pouch? Yes, I would. Thank you so much. All right. There are still sneaky grass over here too. I'm not sure if it wanted me to sneak the entire way and not get seen by those guys. Give me stuff. Give me stuff. Excess stuff goes to stash. I mean, which is, which is very nice. I don't know if Aloy has like a bag of holding <laughs> that they are being magically teleported to, but I'm not going to ask questions. I'm just going to appreciate the free things. There, that ladder can get. Yeah, it can. Away we go! Hustle, 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 hustle. Yeah, that's the hustle we like to see. Grapple point. Okay, there's a right wow. there. I think I can reach it if I launch myself off that grapple point. And then up some more. Nope. Aloy? Aloy? Hmm. Yes, this does appear to be a thing that is happening. She doesn't seem to be, like, down to, uh... Go anywhere else? So, you know. Curious. I figured she would jump up to that point, right? Oh, okay. Gotcha. If I read the thing to my, <laughs> to my right. Aha. Uh -huh. My goodness. Okay. So, <clears throat> that's going to play an important role. The, uh, the pull grapple jump. They're really gonna make me scratch my head with all the possibilities with that, so... I'm gonna be prepared by keeping it in mind at all times. When in doubt, pull grapple oh, jump. Hello, chest. I enjoy your supplies. Go, Aloy. She's so good at what she do. Just being a mighty hunter. Storm's getting bad. Storms are brewing. I should be aware of. Nay. Okay. Ooh, that was smooth. You see how she got up? That was smooth. Yeah. Parkour! Oh! Ah! Uh, yeah. Go! I was close. I concur. One rickety tower down. On to the next. Oh, I like how she gets up like that. That is smooth. There is a cable here. Maybe I can ride it to the other side. Ah, uh, the adventures of Loot Horror. Uh, uh, well, nowhere to go but up. Yeah, yeah, it is. Stupid thousand year old ruins. Why couldn't you be made better? Ah, we've entered an open area. Like there are massive clamps holding the shuttle in place. There are robots. Oh, but there's a control console nearby. If I can release the clamps, the shuttle should fall. Give them the clamps! 
Alright. Is this going right to stash as well? Yeah, hell yeah, sent to my stash. I'll pick up all the things. Oh, great. The machine's in my way. You saw nothing. Chase the rock, buddy. Chase the rock. Stabby, stabby. Let me pick up the rock, because we're good at this. Ha! Stealthy hunter Aloy to defeat machines. Scrapper. El Scrapo, come come, my my lovely machine friend. I don't mean you any harm. Closer. Clo closer. <laughs> oh, you. You're just like my cat. Just like slightly out of range. You want the pets. You want to die. <sighs> but just out of hand's reach. Well then, turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Silent Strike! Back into the shadows of <laughs> the red weeds. Homeboy's over here. Stealthy, stealthy, stealthy. Science right! This place to myself now. Stealth killed ten machines. Oh, it's gonna be way more than that, my friend. Believe you me. Control console might be in there. It may also not be in there. Can I tag these? No, I cannot. It would be nice if I could just tag loot through my uh, focus. But that would make it too easy, wouldn't it? Damaged cable character. Interesting. Now the thing about that is that might be story related. So I can't get up there unless I do story things. Right. So there's no... Okay, so there's a lift. I will be using the lift later. Let's go where intended. We gotta, we gotta muscle through this uh, prologue. Hello, console. And crush those machines down below. Release shuttle clamps. Murder robots. I did it. I got him. Still doing it. You guys wait patiently for death, please. The shuttle's caught up in those cables. I'm gonna have to climb the tower to find a way to disconnect them. Ah, smart Lori. Oh, good. Wow, that happened. No loot up here? Good. Alright, moving on. We must progress towards the forbidden quest. Scanning with my focus could help here. Yeah, good. Tag target. Why would I want to tag the lift, really? Yeah. I see you, baby. I'm recognizing the support struts. I get it now. I'm wise to the disguise. I'm hip. 
I'm cool. Rory knows what's up. <laughs> well, that was terrifying. I felt my stomach sink. Like, as soon as I missed it, I was like, oh no. <laughs> oh no, I've died. I've killed Aloy. I mean, it wouldn't be the first time. You play the first game on the hardest setting. Uh, there are a few deaths that you uh, undertake. Those cables quick. Yeah, we do. Okay. Go. Aloy had to Batman pose there for a moment. Just like I am the knight. Yeah, you are Aloy, but you know, haste is important. Huh? This should be the right spot. There. That connector is holding the cables together. It should break if I shoot it. A little bit of that cable almost tried to kill me. I just need to climb higher and attach the second set of cables. I'm higher indeed. <clears throat> I saw the grapple thing too late. Couldn't do anything about it. I tried. Believe me, folk. I tried. Probably not hard enough, but <laughs> I gave it a good college try. When will you realize Varl's always right? <laughs> Alright. Attempt number two. I wonder if I can hit the grapple. Jump up! I was figuring we might have to do the grapple jump, but no, it was cool. I was close enough. See how Alo like reaches up? When you hold it in a specific position, that means like, oh, I can jump to that. It's fine. So if we get into a situation where she doesn't do that, it's like, okay, I need to find an alternate path up. Yes, swing Aloy. Why wouldn't I take all of them? Almost there. <laughs> There's the other connector. Shooty, shooty. Really? You son of a bitch. That's on me. Die, mongrels! <laughs> That's gotta be a bunch of experience, right? Award me with experience! Oh, uh, good. No. Yeah. I agree. It's not an ideal situation. Just surf this bad boy down. Look at that. <laughs> run, Aloy, run! You're doing it. I believe in you. I believed, and I still believe. Ah, Christ Almighty, no! He wants to murder me. Let's switch it up slightly. Hmm. You seem not to care about that. Let me go into the notebook. 
into the machine catalog and get a, a good glimpse of the Slitherfang. Alright, so your Sonic Hood, obviously. We need to destroy the fuck out of that. It's, it is weak against frost damage, so I should build more of that. You got your Earth Grinder. Crushing nearly anything it ensnares. Tear off to collect. Key upgrade resource. Component is valuable for upgrading weapons or outfits. Well, alright. Maybe I should try shooting that down. Man, you got a lot of weak points, buddy. Storage canisters. Okay. Central prospector. Processor especially vulnerable to damage if exposed. So we got... Man, hitting you in the back seems really good. Alright. Uh, let us focus on that front container. The earth grinder. So I need to see about creating more of these. Crafty, crafty. Eat it, nerd! Eat it, nerd! Oh my goodness! He was not hungry. <laughs> Find a rock. Craft more things. Murder snake. Eat it, nerd! No, I don't like that. Alright, switch to the boat. Hit the earth grinder. Shit. <laughs> you ran out of arrows, Rory! There. Those canisters are exposed now. I should aim for them. Yeah, easier said than done. Yeah. Not happy, are you? Okay. You seem distraught and unhappy, Mr. Snake. I would appreciate it if you were not. Oh, but I broke free. I gotta take this thing down fast. When my focus might find something I can use around here. Oh my goodness, okay. I'm gonna need you to stop, friend. Oh, come on, that was totally it. Ooh, hello! Nope. Nope. I want to pick you up. Ooh, eat a nerd. Oh my goodness. No I'm gonna need you to stop, please. Thank you. Ugh. Man, I forget how much this the fighting in this it's is dead. so good. Finally. Spend skill points. Well, don't mind if I do. Oh, you're gonna give me five, six skill trees? <laughs> oh boy. Alright, you have earned your first skill point. Skill points are gained by leveling up and completing quests and activities. Choose a skill tree and tap X to open it. So, uh, warrior. Unlock new melee combos and increase melee damage and effectiveness. Includes weapon techniques for warrior bows, which specialize in close quarter combat. Interesting. Trapper. Increase the effectiveness of food and traps, and the amount of traps that can be placed includes weapon techniques for trip casters and rope casters. I do like setting traps, especially when you're going against something big, much like the Slither Dude. Hunter. Increase ranged combat effectiveness and improve weapon stamina and concentration. Includes weapon techniques for hunter bows and bolt blasters, which specialize in mid-range combat. Survival! Increase the effectiveness of healing and potions and gain benefits while in low health. Include weapon techniques for blastlings and shredder gauntlets. Shredder gauntlets do tell more. 
Infiltrator. Reduce visibility and movement noise and increase damage dealt while in stealth. Include weapon techniques for sharp shot bows, which specialize in long range combat. Oof. That does sound sexy. If this were Skyrim, that's essentially what I would be doing. I would be playing a sneaky uh, uh, bow person. Machine Master. Increase the effectiveness of the ov overriding machines and the durability and damage dealt from overridden machines, including weapon techniques for spike throwers, which excel against large machines. Let's take a look at the... Oh my goodness, it is... What? Okay, so these are the different skill trees. Cool, 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 cool. So the Infiltrator doesn't quite have as much as the other ones. Like this one goes down hella far. And then this is the mid-range one. With just the regular bows. This is the trap one. And this is the melee one. Alright, so let's go back over to the infiltrator real quick. And check out this ability. Stealth Stalker. Learn connected skills to unlock. So I gotta learn these ones here to unlock this. Activate a cloaking device based on stalker technology to decrease visibility to enemies. Aiming a weapon or using melee attacks temporarily deactivates the device. Oh boy, is that dope. Fire a powerful shot from a kneeling position that explodes on impact. Use up to three arrows of your currently selected type and deplete a large amount of weapon stamina. Oh my goodness. Radial blast. Attach an overcharged module to your spear and immediately trigger a powerful shockwave, damaging all enemies in the vicinity. I mean, dope. Increase your weapon zoom while aiming and fire a powerful shot that deals extra damage. Uses your currently selected arrow type and depletes a medium amount of stamina. The double notch. Load a second arrow. Oh, man. So what I'm going to do... Is I'm going to... I'm not going to read all of these. I'm going to look at them and edit me looking out, <laughs> looking at them, and kind of give you a rundown of what I think and what I'm going to be doing. How does that feel? It feels good. Let's go. I'll see you in a moment. All right, what I've decided is to go into Elemental Fury right here, which is in the Traps tree. I thought about what I think other people would be doing, and I need to look around what I'll be doing. Uh, something oddball and off the chain. I think I have an idea, and I'm keeping it secret for the time being, of uh, what I want to go into with each of the trees. Um, but Elemental Fury is super dope because, you know, bolster your resolve and increase the buildup and effect of elemental attacks while gaining a greater resistance to elemental damage. Elemental buildup 100%. Elemental damage is great. Fire, ice, lightning, and uh, I'm not sure if they have the corrosion anymore. But that is really valuable when it comes to doing a uh, considerable amount of DPS, um, reliable DPS, because it's constantly ticking with a dot on the enemy. And sometimes, especially with lightning, you can um, bring about critical strikes super easily. So I think that's what I'm going to go into. And the elemental state duration plus 50%, it lasts longer. So I'm doing more reliable constant dot damage to, to enemies. Yeah. And then it gives me plus 20 elemental resistance. The first thing I need to do is get Quick Trapper. So I can basically set traps faster. Sure, let's do it. It is done. So obviously I'm going to need to get these on the side. Now, does it, do I just automatically get it when I get these two? Because I won't see... Elemental Fury until level 5, essentially. Yeah. Which is, which is fine for the time being, you know? I'm fine with it. Also, I can't stand having these little symbols that say like, Hey, there's something in here you need to look at. I have to get rid of them. I feel weird if I don't. My goodness. Alright, I'm gonna skip you saying this. Because it's just going to be annoying. Yes. Varro. The poor boy. You know what I should have done is probably put down a trap or something. I want to carry this with me. Can I? No. That would be silly. To what point and purpose? 
Like, I could have set down some, some blast traps. I didn't. I am a fool. I will next time, though. Now that I know I'm, like, going into traps, I need to use traps a lot more. They were like, here's a lot of berries because we think you're going to get hit a lot. That's fair, game. <laughs> That's fair. What I need is my sweet turbo. Jump. I was just practicing that. It's dope. I'm going to use it a lot. All right. I can rebirth Gaia. Fix the system. Heal the blight. Heal the blight. Restore Elizabeth's dream. I bet it's going to be just that easy. Oh, is it still there? What if the game just ended okay. right here? It's like, good job, you I won. The server room. Search the data center. I'm sure there's a bunch of delicious data to put in your data face. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not looking when I leap. <laughs> I should probably do that. It's like that's an idiom for a reason, you know? <laughs> what do we have here? A text log. What to do about Dalgard? Data corrupted. On to the matter of Mr. Dalgard. He's been a valuable member of Farzenith for years. Even Peter saw the need for a polished spokesman to preserve anonymity for the rest of us. But with all the new members we recruited to increase funds for the Odyssey's expedited timeline, there are simply not enough berths on the ship to accommodate. Cuts have to be made. And let's face it, Oswald lacks the skill set for our future aims. Good, I'm glad he was left behind on Earth to fucking die. <laughs> I just don't like him. I just don't like the guy. I don't know why. He'll retaliate if we exclude him, of course, so we'll have to give him a proper send-off, but that doesn't mean that his usefulness uh, must end. We have plenty of source material to generate a digital puppet giving us the means to data corrupted. Interesting. Alright. You want me to go that in way, which means I'm going any way but that in way. Until there are no more ways to go. Because I'm a loot hole, baby. Yeah. Can I get inside you? No, I can't. Alright, so that wasn't much to wasn't wasn't much. Wasn't much to explore there. What's going on, Eloy? Reach for the stars. Completed main quest. XP five hundred. Ooh. I think that's a lot. It's here. Gaia version 6.9. <laughs> Initializing. Nice. Hello. Hi, Gaia. Hi. Ooh, you're a bit corrupted. Elizabeth? Travis Tate. Now, what's this we got here? I like Travis. Farzine's conspiracy to steal a copy of Gaia? And her subordinate functions? Naughty, naughty. You want me to handle this, Liz? What a great hacker. I love him. Blasphemers! Brew the vipers! With a mighty hand, I smite and pour troubles upon you. <laughs> God damn it, Travis. Thou shalt not steal a super advanced terraforming system. This ain't no copy of guy you stole, you losers. But it's the mother of all logic bombs. So good luck repairing your data. And next time you start thinking you can outsmart a tape, remember my salute. I love Tate so much. I want to listen hey, to some death metal with him. The goddess. 
No, not quite. There is no goddess. <laughs> I told you that already. Give up your faith, you dumbo! It's not, Gaia. it's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. Well, we tried. <laughs> Poor Varl. <laughs> His world is collapsing around him. So is that why Odyssey failed? Because Tate corrupted their files? Because their ship did not make it to Sirius, as far as I'm concerned. All the reports said it didn't. Well, that was our last chance. I got it. What now, Aloy? To the Verbidden West? I'm sorry. You have a sharp bite sometimes, you know. But it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin. The thing is, um, there's going to be more of that. I'm out of leads, Varl. But I, I have to keep searching. And fast, and whatever risks I have to take, I will. Yeah, it take risks. It makes sense to have someone with me. Someone who might get hurt. This is on me, Varl. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world, things no one else understands. And he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone, Varl. I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure, but Spymaster Murad back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? Varl, I... <sighs> Come on, it might work. Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces again. <laughs> okay. I... I guess it's worth a shot. We've got a long walk ahead. To Meridian! Actually... I've got a better idea. Let's ride some stalkers. <laughs> Poor Varl. He's so bad at this. So terrifying. <laughs> Smile. Smile at the anointed. I'm having fun. <laughs> Can't you see I'm having fun? <laughs> New interlude. The point of the lance. Yes, yes, it is I, Aloy. And my male concubine, Varro. She's come back. Bless us. The savior of Meridian has returned. That is right. Welcome. I am Aloy. Not yet. In the name of the Sun King of Vard, a royal welcome for the champion. What's up, homeboy? He knows things. Right. Aloy has an urgent matter to discuss. And he's blameless. That makes two of us. I've sent forth hunters for weeks. The sun fall all the way to the sacred land, searching for you. Something happened at the spire. Come. I'll show you. I don't like that at all. Watch your step. You saved us all, to be sure, but uh, we're still cleaning up the mess. <laughs> Get to work, motherfucker. <laughs> Bruh, don't gawk at the savior. It happened right after the solstice. We were able to explain it away, thank the sun. Otherwise, it might have caused a panic. What's going on, Murad? You put a statue of me here? All right, I accept. One night, for less than half a minute, it glowed an angry red. From Meridian, it looked like a trick of the light. But those who were closer, atop the light, said it could not have been a reflection. Much to my dismay, they said the light rose up from the tower's base. And that. We left everything just as it was. What do you think happened? I don't know. The Spire is supposed to send out signals, messages, for the terraforming system. But Hades tried to use it to wake up ancient war machines. I was sure I got the connection to that thing. Wait here while I check it out. 
Poor Varl. Let us know what you find. It's like I want to do things. I want to be <sighs> someone you rely on. Check around first. You don't see. Machine carcasses. Remnants from the Battle of the Alight. I always thought the uh, the music in here was very Firefly esque, you know, Firefly and Serenity. Nope. What? Get Aloy up. The orb remains Ow. untouched, as for blameless mirage instructions. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Don't mind me climbing on you, sir. Just Aloy doing Aloy things. Think nothing of it. <laughs> Examine. We were almost overrun by the machines Hades controlled. But we pushed through. We sure did. You're not gonna let me up there, are you? Nay. Nay, nay, they shall not let Oh! I did a thing. There's Meridian. Still standing, despite the battle against Hades and the eclipse. Yoink! Metal bone. Meridian's a beautiful city. Any other valuables I could scrump? Oh snap, I gotta destroy these boys. Eat it, nerd. Got that shield. That shield does not want to go. Bang. Bang. I shield. I have defeated you for all time, dummy. I've done it. I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, well, we're doing it anyway. Looks the same as before. I could pull this thing out of the box. Happen. You need to defragment your spear, girl. Transmission. Yeah. That was on purpose, everyone who saw. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> it's a dope spear. Silence doing something? Yes, yes he would. Something was transmitted from the top of the spire. I guess I have to find a way up there. Climby, climby. Uh, maybe I can jump to that ledge behind me. Maybe you can. What? Did it. I'm the greatest of all time. Climby, climby. Oh, you're just gonna make me do this again, eh? Be able to jump back and reach those ropes behind me. And then we'll jump to the side. Hoo ya! <laughs> Incorrect. <laughs> it was a nice try, Aloy. Hold in the desired direction and tap. That's what I did do last time. How dare you? Come here! 
like everyone down below watching me like, what is the savior doing? Shush, just watch. She's amazing. Looks like I can use my pull caster on that. Yoink. Should be able to get up there now. Just, almost just fucking smack the shit out of myself with that. I'm so good at this. Oh my lord. None of you saw that. None of you. And if you tell anyone what you saw here today, so god help me. I honestly don't know what happened just then. I'll blame it on something else, other than me just being an old man who has a dwindled amount of video game ability from when he was much younger. And then we push the circle. No, oh, I wanted to do the mega jump. Looks like he tricked me. Transmitted something through the spire. Did he save Hades? Yes, he did. Why would he do that? Because he's a dick. Figure out where he sent it. I can track him down. Hopefully, the transmission note at the top will tell me. Looks like this panel's a jar. Is it a panel or is it a jar? That joke is so old it can get senior benefits. Elevator? Let's see. Tell me your secrets. Noise. Engaging maintenance configuration. The whole thing is opening up. Wonder what the carja will make of this. You know, this is just go only going to increase your uh <laughs> your savior status. The savior is moving metal with her mind. She is truly the greatest. Tell me your secrets, Beacon. <laughs> oh boy. Sword of the Far West. The Forbidden West, perhaps? Well, Eloy. I see you finally figured it out. Hi, Silence. To be honest, I'm surprised it took you so long to discover my rules. Yeah. You rigged the lands to steal Hades. How could you be so reckless? Reckless? You're the one who tried to purge Hades before its precious knowledge could be extracted. Bro, you don't want that knowledge. The mysterious signal that woke it, for example. But why don't you one of those guy backups you've been having such a hard time finding? If you knew, why didn't you just tell me? I've been having problems of my own these past six months, Eloy. The difference is, I've made progress. So what's your you? anger at my entirely necessary deception has faded? Now why don't you come out here and find me in the Forbidden West and learn all that I've discovered? Oh, I'll come find you, all right. <laughs> oh, I'll come. Oh, I'm finding you. <laughs> well, the coordinates should make it simple enough. Even for you. What a dick. I know, right? Who does he think he is? Got that lame matrix name, Silence. Might as well just be Cypher. Hello. Everyone ignore what just happened. Better let Varl and Murad know what I found. He went inside it, and it transformed. Almost like the day of the battle. I can only be grateful that it's a stormy day. Few will have seen the tower change from Meridian. Well... Yeah. What did you discover? 
Hades. The danger didn't end here. It went into the Forbidden West. And I have to follow. I see. That can be difficult. The West is called Forbidden for a reason. Because it's so dope. The ferocious warriors controls much of it. The Tanakh. And they allow no trespassers past its border. That's it. Under the Sun King of Art, a fragile peace has been negotiated. And indeed, the next embassy will take place in a day or two on the edge of the frontier. Were you to attend the gathering under his auspices, the Tanakh might grant right of passage instead of hunting you and attacking on sight. I would like not to be hunted. More killers. The Sun King. Avad. He's a good dude, and I like him. Aloy. I see you have child It's good now. to see you. You left in such haste. We never had a chance to. Oh, no, that was the. Uh, Can we show the champion the spear now? The other Please? kid. Yeah. It's a man. Quiet. It's true. We bear gifts. Decorum usually calls for a ceremony of offering at the palace, but I thought you would prefer a less formal occasion. You thought right. Bring them, please. Avad, this is all very kind, but I... Who's it? Vinasha. Quick. Better hand them over before she runs off again. <laughs> really? Must you? I like the Vinasha gal. She's great. Try it on. It's beautiful. On behalf of all the citizens of the Sundom, may these tokens remind you of our eternal gratitude. They will, and I may not sell them. Uh, that depends on the price. The spear, I suppose, I'll keep. The tiara, perhaps, uh, will be sold. Perhaps you'd like to spend more time with your friends. Come speak to me when you're ready to depart. I got a dope spear. I need to attach the master override to my new spear. Should be a workbench around here I can use. A battle We need. <laughs> Hello. It is an honor for you. You are correct. Super cool secret stuff. I do like super cool secret stuff. Hey. You guys are working hard or what's going on over there? The sounds I'm hearing. Not saying I don't like it, but oof. Wee. Okay. It goes good. Also, Hammerhead. I know you're not talking to me. I just want to feel included. Being a savior is so difficult sometimes. Ignoring me again. Honoring those who fell in the battle of the Alight. Lots of brave people defended this place from Hades. Yeah, done, dude. With me? Sure is. That's new. You don't like it? I think it captures your likeness well. That's part of the Deathbringer we defeated. Yeah, it was a dick. This machine was the last line of defense for Hades. It dragged the orb up here and then nearly killed me, but it's just a piece of scrap now. Where are my friends to speak with? It's only showing me that option. I suppose right here. Yo, what up, girl? 
Dowager Queen Masadi. Blessed champion. Itaman, what do you say? My humblest thanks to you, great champion, for delivering my mother and me from Sunfall and for yes, defending the Shadow Karja. city against the forces of shadow. Did I say right? You no. said it fine. <laughs> no, you're bad Roger at this, child. Champion, will you teach me how to shoot like a real machine hunter? No. Men. I, uh, I have to go on an important mission, Prince. To save the world? Something like that. Essentially, yes. <laughs> it's never stops for a savior. When I come back, I could give you a few tips. It would be an honor. We owe you our lives, champion. And we will not forget. May the sun light your way. Watch out Word. for Thunderjaws, champion! Yeah, I will. And I'll shoot off their cannons and handily take care of them. Hello, Avad. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> the sculptor wanted something even bigger, twice the size, covered in gold and jewels. But I was quite certain you wouldn't appreciate that. You were right. <laughs> Thank you. I'm sorry. Avad. Must be tiring on the arms to do that it's constantly. Good to see you, but I can't stay long. I see. I'd hoped you'd remain in the city for a time. Perhaps at the palace. Meridian's Thirsty for the Aloy. Danger, but it's bigger than I mean, that. we all are. To put things right, I have to go west. To Noxth territory. By the sun, that's a Noxth? Well, perhaps Murad already told you, but... After years of hostility, we've negotiated a truce. In hopes of a lasting peace. Another embassy will be held in just a day or two. When you say years of hostility, I assume you mean the Red Raids? Ah, yes. My favorite subject. I wouldn't ask if I didn't need to know. As you know, my father raided all the border tribes. Asaram, Banuk, and Nora suffered greatly, resisting as best they could. But none fought back like the Tanakh. Huh. They rose up and assaulted our western front of barren light, sweeping us from their lands. Getting them to talk to us again after that was tricky. Yeah. It was a hard time for Anora. How did you get the Tanakhs to talk again after the war? The same way I got you to talk. By giving gifts. <laughs> the Tanakh like tiaras? <laughs> More like metals, spices, and relics looted during the fighting. We'll settle for some spices, yo. We've met with them on several occasions. And the gift seemed to have eased the tension. But this coming embassy is the most important yet. The best sign we've had so far that the Tanakh want lasting peace. What makes this coming embassy so special? Well, just like today, it is special because of the guest. Ooh, Our delegation smooth will talker. Just outside Baron Light. We'll give them treasure, and they'll return a prisoner. Fashav, one of our finest soldiers. Soldier? Don't you mean raider? No. Not in this case. Fashav is my cousin. Nothing like Helis and his ilk. Ugh, Helis. He joined the Western Expedition with the hopes of reining in certain excesses. But he was captured during a heroic defense of our forward base at Cinnabar Sands. Cinnabon Sands? Sounds tasty. Your cousin, Fashav. How long has he been a Tanakh captive? Twenty years. Five years? Tanakh emissaries swear he is well, but I wonder. That tribe is renowned for its brutality. How did he survive? How do your oh, prisoners fare? I'll know soon enough. You'll know, you're known for your brutality as if well, you see him the Red Raid. Night, tell him that I await him in Meridian, where he belongs. If I see him... I will. Itaman looks happy. And you got him out of Sunfall. It's quite the... Any happiness oh, he it's has, a stick. I thought it was a sword. I was like, Jesus Christ. I know he's got a sword on his hip, but still. He's turning into a fine young man. Which he'll need to be if he's to inherit the crown. 
Wouldn't the crown go to a son of yours first? Yes, well. I'd have to get married for that to happen. And he's waiting on you. Murad keeps throwing noble matches at me. But I find I'm I would like to think Murad is actually throwing them just like yeah, marry that one. To someone they're not. At any rate, I never aspired to the throne, and I don't wish to sit there forever. When Edaman comes of age, I hope to step aside. That's just ugh, the crowd, sign of a good leader. I might finally be able to travel the world. Who knows? Perhaps even accompany you on one of your adventures. You make it sound easy. I... Uh, Peace. I need to get going. Uh, one moment, Aloy. There's something I must ask you. Since you left, I've thought of little else. This isn't really the time. But it has to be. The way you left before, there's no way to know when I'll see you again. I'm not trying to stop you. Or hold you back. But I need to know. When your mission is over, will you return to Meridian? And stay? Long enough for us to... Spend time to get to know each other properly, perhaps. Oh, flashpoints offer moments of emotional choice. How Aloy expresses her personality is up to you. Choose fist, and Aloy will confront the challenge directly. Choose brain, and Aloy will use her insight to find a clever, less obvious approach. Choose heart, and Aloy will express compassion or give voice to her deepest convictions. I mean, it is a nice thought, and I do like Avad. He is an attractive man, and he's smart, and he's of good rule. It's a nice thought. I want to give him that comfort, but I don't want to lead him on, because there might be other options out there for me. Now is not the time is appropriate. However, it still feels cold. Are you kidding? We're obviously not doing that. Are you kidding? Bitch, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> We're not doing that to him. Uh... Now's not the time, Avard, dude. The, the situation calls for a, a higher perspective. The threat I'm facing endangers not just Meridian, but a lot of other places too. A lot of innocent people. What happens between us, it's not important. At least, not yet. You're right. I'm acting like a fool. You're not. You're just following your heart, dude, and it's I appreciate the king that. who calls for a higher perspective. Please accept my apology. And my wishes for your success. Bro, I'm sorry. Goodbye, Eloy. As always, our hopes ride with you. He put down his arms to the side. Ugh. Ugh. I'm sorry, Avod, man. There. The workbench. Uthid. Vanasha. Thanks for being here. Especially Vanasha. Wouldn't miss it. Even if you did leave us hanging after the big battle. Vanasha, stop. She's here now, isn't she? For the moment. But I see that look on her face. She's got business to attend to. And it isn't in Meridian. You know, I didn't vanish before because I wanted to. I had- No, Huntress. Please. You don't have to justify yourself to us. You no, save our butts. If you've got to go, go. With our blessing. Always. You both look like you're doing well. Yeah. Mr. Shiny Pants here is now the Sun King's senior military advisor. Oh, snap. That means people actually have to listen to him talk. May the sun bless their sorry souls. At least I say something of substance every once in a while. What was that? I just fell asleep while you were talking. And how about you, Vanasha? I've been spicy as always. Sadi and Edaman, two parts bodyguard, one part bad influence. Huh. I was gonna say nanny, but I like your version better. I never pictured you as a nanny. Adam Such great uh, costuming now. on I'm them. Not great ideas. 
Nasadi was the mad Sun King's wife. She has enemies. I've had to foil a plot or two. Right. You can try to hide it, but inside, you're as soft as a silk pillow. I oh, hope she is. You have Rar. no idea. <laughs> uh, oh dear. Uh, we were talking about Edaman? Yeah. Okay, I admit it. Edaman's cute. He's fun. And he looks up to me. I like him. Except when he forgets to wash his hands after hooking worms in that muddy garden behind a solarium. Blech. It's been months since I was in Sunfall. What's become of the Shadow Karja? <laughs> after you wiped out the Eclipse, there were hardly any priests or officers left to terrorize the little people. Avad offered amnesty to all who were forced to serve the Shadow. Because he's a good so dude. the commoners cleaned out the Citadel and handed it back to him. The Sundom was unified. Avad wanted Uther to take command of the garrison there, but Captain Cudley here refused. Rumor has it that he wanted to stay close to me here in Meridian. <laughs> That's nonsense, of course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I, I know. I know. You're out. Go! Away with you. Always an honor, champion. Always a pleasure. But please, little Huntress, come back someday and tell us about your adventures. I if I will. can't get in trouble, at least I can hear about yours. Yes. Upgrade. Okay. Master override installed. Plus, she named it Mr. Override. To store up and release energy. Uh resonator. Should help in a fight. My goodness. I do believe that's where we're gonna end for this. I think I uh, I went over my time just a little bit, but I couldn't help myself. I gotta be out there. I gotta be adventuring. And I have to take you on this adventure with me. And I appreciate you being there with me every step of the way. I hope you're enjoying. I know I am. My goodness, what an adventure we've been on so far. If you're feeling generous, you can pop on down to my Patreon and subscribe over there. That's patreon.com backslash Rory's Brainworks. They are my rope and video game vanguard, my colonizers of dreams. And without them, all the ropey video game endeavors that I do would be <laughs> way harder to accomplish. Thank you for spending your time with me. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and follow my other social medias for updates. As always, I'm Rory, this is my Gameworks, and I'll see you next time.